We are coming up on the end of the summer season and getting ready to go into fall. But I wanted to show you guys the mess in my garden because I wanted you guys to understand that not everything grows perfectly and everything is on a life cycle and it does die. It's okay. <laughs> I have been dealing with nonstop nightly storms and so what's happening is these are getting way too much moisture on them in South Carolina. We have a lot of moisture already in the air and it's really easy for this stuff to take hold. And unfortunately, it usually does this time of year. I'm actually shocked I've held it off for this long. These tomatoes here, these were the ones that had the disease early on. They still have some disease. They are actually dying off somewhat. This gets to come out of here. The beans, they're all kind of yellowing now. I've left some on now and I'm gonna stop picking so that I can save them for seed. You'll see they'll start to get really big that is okay. You want to leave them there and let them dry. But this is normal this time of year. This used to be a, a patty pan squash. I ripped that one out because it had some borer damage. So that one is gone. And I still have this one here and one over there. I lost a plant, but it's okay. It's the end of the season. And look at this one. This one's got tons of fruit coming on it. So you know what? No big deal. This kale, probably going to get ripped out. It's all eaten and we'll get some new stuff planted for the fall. Because of the weather that we've had, I haven't been able to get in here and do my daily inspections like I like to do to remove anything that doesn't belong. So unfortunately, these look like I might lose them at some point. I need to come in here and do some trimming. You know, anything that's yellowing and decaying, I got to pull out of here.